Good morning, everyone. How are you doing on this beautiful Ohio day? It is the end of the day for us, but just got home from Sean's baseball game and decks need cleaned out, blades need changed because we've been cutting messes all week long and uh, yeah, they're overdue at the moment. So it's going to be a little late night. It's probably about 9-ish, maybe 8.30-ish. I don't even know. We just got done with the game right around 8, so... Super proud day here, dropping off our shipment to Schleybaugh's. Hey Sean and TQ, it's Matt with Doughboys Lawn Care. We're out here at Schleybaugh's and I knew you couldn't make it out, but I wanted to send you a little video uh, for a couple reasons. One, I wanted to say thank you and I wanted to let you know just how much your videos and your channel means to small companies like us. Um, I wouldn't be where I am today if it wouldn't be for videos from like you guys and Brian's Lawn Maintenance. So I wanted to share my gratitude and say thank you. Um, and kind of just show you, it, a year ago we were out here at your Spencer Pro event and I dreamed about owning one of these machines and I didn't know that I'd be able to get there. Um, made it work. We're here a year later, out of Sleigh Balls, picking up our new tour, well, new to us, multi-course, and uh, I wanted to show you something. I was informed when I got out here that that right there is the very first flex chute that Sleigh Balls installed, and I love it. I think it's a great design. I think it's gonna hold up. I think you got a great thing going for it. So uh, I just wanted to send this. I wanted to say thank you. I wanted to let you know that your flex chute is gonna make an appearance in Pennsylvania. It's gonna be cutting lines, laying stripes, and uh, I love it. So thanks again. I know you probably don't hear it, um, or you might not hear it, but uh, what you do means something to people. So thank you. Keep up the good work. Keep up creating the content and keep doing what you're doing for the industry. This is Matt from Doughboys. See you later, bud. Hey, Matthew. Thank you for sending the video over. I literally just got it. We appreciate you so much, and thank you for being the first purchaser through our dealer network to buy a flex shoot. We couldn't be happier for you. Sorry, I dropped them off yesterday, or the day before now at this point, and then, you know, obviously you got the very first one, so big congratulations to you, and uh, thank you. I know for some of you guys, you don't understand the cheesiness side of, I guess, you know, like the headache and all the work that goes into something like this. And then to finally see like, bro, we're in a dealership. Like I never could imagine this. Like if you'd have told me 2018, when we first came to Schleybaugh's, Mike Nussbaum told me about them. He's like, come check them out. They're awesome. Best Toro dealership around. And I know Ruben doesn't like me saying that. <sighs> Something special, guys. Fast forward four or five years, and we have a product that we're so proud of in a dealership. And this is just going to be one of many. This is, this is just the first one. The first one. And... <laughs> I'll tell you what, if any of you have a dream, please chase it. You just never know. You never know. And I don't know. Maybe this is one of, that's it. Maybe we only sell, you know, the first batch of them and then nothing. I don't know. But I do know that whenever I hit the end of the road, I want to say, you know what, we, we tried. We, we gave it our best. And uh, whether it succeeds or fails, you know, that's only in God's hands, and uh, all of this is because of him, and he has blessed us so, so much, and uh, yeah, we, we won't forget that. We won't forget that. Creeper. <laughs> White girl's got jumps. Oh, yeah? <laughs> all right, guys, so good morning. 
gonna get the day rocking and rolling and uh yeah we're still dealing with these wet lawns i do want to say after today it's game over for the nice cool weather though you see that stuff it's gonna get toasty they're saying back in the 90s humidity is going to push us close to 100 if not over it they said record breaking hot temperatures for us here in ohio what is going on i swear tq they're trying to take us out you know what's going to go on hmm. i'm going to trim this whole hillside yeah just kidding The customer here takes care of the rest. Uh, she dislikes the mow still, so she doesn't like getting near the hill. It scares her and we take care of the trimming around it as well. But uh, yeah, she's been a great customer of ours, long time customer.
wanted to share this with you guys. I've never seen this before. Be down on my deck. So I noticed when I was mowing certain parts of the lawn, it was like coming up out of the ground. I don't know if it says iron or what, but it's all over. It works sometimes. Here, I'll show you. So you just want to flip it and catch the bar. You grab me the hard edge, I'll hit that flip. <laughs> Good job. Ooh. Got a little plant here. It's blowing in the wind. All right, that brown's almost gone. Thank goodness. We're gonna be on out of here. Look at the growth on this thing, guys. What is going on? It is literally September. Three, two, one, boom.
Look at this thing, guys. Good to go. When we designed the flex chute, we kept you in mind and gates are a problem, especially for a lot of you that have like 36 inch, 38 inch mowers, okay? Well, what we found when we were doing our research is that most of the chute blockers stuck out a bit far. It's inevitable, it's going to happen. Even ours with our counterweight here for keeping the deck chute open, it's out too far. But what we did is we designed it so that whenever you opened it up, you're now actually recessed back further than the deck itself. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, keep mowing, keep growing, keep making money, boys. Happy Labor Day weekend. Talk to you later. TQL. Peace. Bye.